Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how I put together my meal prepped barbecue chicken salads. These came out absolutely delicious. Here are the ingredients that I will be using for these. Starting off, I'm just going to be chopping up all of my romaine lettuce and then putting it in my salad spinner. That way I can run these through some water and some produce wash and get my lettuce all nice and clean. Here is the BioClean produce wash that I will be using. It's the first time I've actually ever used any. I just got this off of Amazon. I was a little worried because I was like, oh no, soapy lettuce, but it was totally fine. It rinsed off and got my lettuce all nice and clean. It got all that dirt off of it. Now I'll just be chopping up all of my tomatoes. I clean these with that same produce wash as I did with the romaine lettuce and it got all that wax off the tomatoes so I highly suggest using that stuff. I'll just be putting these over a paper towel on a plate just so it gets all of that excess water out. And then now I'll just be chopping up my red onion. For these, I decided to use chicken tenderloins. These are super lean and you can have up to six ounces of this for only one smart point. I just sprayed my pan with some nonstick cooking spray and I'll be adding the chicken tenderloins. I always cook extra just because I'll end up using these for dinner or you know some other recipe and it's nice to have chicken that's already cooked. Here I'll be adding my seasonings. I just did some garlic powder, onion powder, pepper, and I also did some of this Tasty's Tangy seasoning. It's really good. I use this for my chicken now all the time. Now that the chicken is all cooked through, I'm going to be chopping this up and adding them to my meal prep containers. These meal prep containers are amazing. I recently just got them from Costco. I believe the brand is like Elo products or something. I can tag them in the description box down below, but they are so nice. So I'm just going to be chopping up all my chicken to add to the containers and then weighing it out. So I'm going to put my meal prep container on my kitchen scale and then zeroing it out and I'll be weighing out three ounces of chicken to each meal prep container for only one smart point. Now I'll be adding the tomatoes to each of these. I don't measure it out. I just put as much as I like. These are zero points, so. And I like tomatoes. Here I'm going to be adding my black beans and my corn. So I will be reverse weighing this. So zero my scale out and then 21 grams of black beans for zero points. And then I will be doing 37 grams of corn for one point. The other two programs, you really don't need to measure this out because it is zero points, but just be mindful of how much you're using.
Now we'll be putting the cheese in these little containers. I do this because if you just put the cheese on top of anything in there, it kind of gets weird throughout the week. So it makes it nice and fresh when you go to put this on doing it this way. I did 21 grams of this shredded Velveeta for only one smart point and it came out to quite a bit of cheese. Now I'm going to be putting my dressing together. So I'll be using this G Hughes original barbecue sauce. You can have up to three tablespoons of this for zero points. I ended up doing 36 grams just because I like weighing things out. To the barbecue sauce, I'll be adding this Bolt House Ranch. It is my favorite one. And you can have up to nine grams for zero points. So this is a zero point dressing. And when I went to go and eat this, I just kind of mixed it together with the fork that I was using and it was delicious. Now I'm just gonna be taking those little containers and adding some red onions, that way my whole meal prep doesn't smell like an onion. <laughs> Lastly, I will be adding this Cleveland kraut. It's just pickled beets and carrots, I think. It's really good and it worked really good with this salad in particular. Last minute, I decided to add a little bit more of this tasty tangy seasoning. This is what I was seasoning the chicken with when it was cooking and it is delicious. So the meal prep portion of these are all done. I will be adding the croutons, lettuce, and avocado the day of. I ended up using the Kroger cheese and garlic croutons. I did 12 grams for one point, 28 grams of avocado, and then I love a lot of lettuce in my salad, so that way everything is all ready to go when I get home from work, and I'm not having to pull 12 different containers out of the fridge. Everything is just ready to go. There you guys have it. These are five point barbecue chicken salads that are meal prepped and all ready to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe if you're already not and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. See you next time.